good morning. We are still in Luke 24, 13 through 35. And uh, we're examining this as a way of, uh, of growing in Christ and, uh, and also witnessing. So Jesus stayed with them. At the table, he gave thanks, broke bread, and gave it to them. These men were not present at the Last Supper. They were not part of the Twelve. They did know, not know the sacramental, uh, uh, sac- sacred nature of breaking bread. Uh, somehow they knew it was Jesus because of the way he broke bread. When we participate in communion, do we see Jesus or do we see bread and juice? Um, their eyes were open and they recognized him. Jesus may be right in front of your eyes, walking with you, sitting down with you uh, at every meal, uh, but your eyes are constrained from seeing him. We therefore should pray that God would open our eyes to see Jesus. Afterward, he disappeared right before their eyes. Even when they didn't know it was Jesus, even when they didn't believe he had risen from the dead, their hearts, it says, uh, and as we look down, burned. God's word should affect our heart, not just our head. We need to study the works of Jesus to understand how Jesus works. Weren't our hearts burning within us when he talked with us on the road and explained the scriptures, they said. Christians uh, need to have a permanent heartburn. Uh, They need to look at the scriptures. They need to burn inside. They returned to Jerusalem immediately. Uh, After walking seven miles, they decided to go right on back. They had a passion for the news of the resurrected Jesus. How urgent uh, are we with this message? Uh, Where the disciples and others told them, it's all true. The Lord has risen and appeared to Peter. Then the two disciples told what had happened. They traveled on the road to Emmaus, how they recognized Jesus when he broke bread. Jesus does simple things to be recognized. Uh, They had a mutual confirmation of the uh, resurrection of Jesus. Uh, Though the risen Jesus had not physically been in their midst, his resurrection had been confirmed by two witnesses. So we're following Old Testament law. We need to recognize the risen Jesus. That will confirm the message of the scriptures. God bless.